Hi. 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 Hello. It's me again. It's me again. It's me again. I have a lot of friends and all from different countries. My friend remind me, why don't you ask them something to see what the people are from different countries about their own opinion? I think their opinions cannot represent the other people from their country but can represent themselves. And, and let's see what's their ideas about relationship. Hi guys, um, I am from Libya. Shinja, Sarahbar, <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Jing and I'm a Chinese from Malaysia. Hello, Taikaho. Hi everyone. So I did have to call I'm Alice, I'm from Thailand. Today I'm coming for an interview regarding relationship. I wish you guys have a good day. Do you prefer the boys come from your country or other countries? I think that the boys are the boys and the boys are the boys. But there is a little bit of a boy. But I want to see another person. I want to see another person. أو يكونوا كي متفتحين شوية وناضجين لأن في ليبيا يعني كي راسهم ديما مسكر يعني متعاقدين شوية بالمعنى بس I want to try <تصفيق> from my country Malaysia okay why why because I don't have to have long distance relationship <تصفيق> Okay, good reason. To me, mm. another country, definitely, because I have been living outside for a really long time. So I really like uh, international and different mindsets and learning new things and new culture. So we exchange. Mm. Do you think boys should always pay for dating? Yes, yes, I, yeah. yeah. I think <laughs> sure, yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> course if he's the one who's dating us out but if he face financial problems uh, maybe sometimes girls could uh, pay for it yeah, yeah. well <laughs> yes for the first few times okay. <laughs> they should do you think saying i love you is a big deal between couples <laughs> I love you. I want to to sign a love. I love you too. <laughs> of course, you have to show your loved ones you love her or him, right? Every day. Yes, of course. No, I love you. Between couples, actually, we should always say to each other to keep the sweetness Every between day. us. Okay, every two days maximum, <laughs> <laughs> but should be every day. Yes. What do you think about emotional cheating and physical cheating? I think that the feelings and the feelings of the body are the same as some of them are not going to change. It may be different in the feelings, but it's the same. The man is a man is a man. Yes, okay? I don't like the man. Any person who is a man 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 no, I cannot. I mean, no, yeah. For physical cheating, I think it's definitely unacceptable mm. because how can you be with someone and then you go and have some happy times with another girl or guy? For mentally cheating, it's still cheating, but it's like before physical cheating. Yeah, it's like you plan to cheat. This question, viewers, <laughs> I hate cheaters, and physical cheating is really, really big matter for me. I, I, from my perspective, I can love the person, but 
the minute that I understand he shit on me, I will never can accept this. I'll just cut off. We are done. What do you think about long distance relationships? I think that the relationship is a long time and a long time. I think that it's a very nice thing. Really? Yeah. I mean, they are all together and they are all together. I think that it's good. Maybe. I think that it's good. Even if they are all together and they love so much. Good. It's very tough to maintain a relationship when it, mm. it has long distance. I've been through one and it didn't end well because he cheated. Yeah. So <laughs> trust issues, insecurities. Okay. Yeah. But if you made through this long disti distance relationship, it will definitely be a very stable relationship. Yeah. Yeah. To me. Mm. It is difficult to everyone, I believe. But um, as long as you have very strong connection, you keep in touch, you make sure that you really talk to each other every day, contact each other all the time, give each other motivation, or we can meet like once or twice in a year, it is okay. <laughs> <laughs> once or twice in a yeah, year? Yeah, it's okay to me. I don't know for uh -huh. other people, but to me it's okay. Mm. But if long relationship and one of the couples is busy and no time for each other, of course love will fade away. It is very logical. Do you think marriage is necessary in life? If yes, when is the good timing? I think that the marriage is necessary in life. Yes, I think that because in Islam and our religion, so this is very important in life. This is our religion. فممكن الوقت اللي قصد اللي احنا نتجوزوا فيه او شيء زي هو ممكن بعد القرايه بعد ما تحققي شنو ما تحبي او يعني تديري المشروع الخاص بك وتكملي قرايتك وبعدين تفكري في الجواز لان شيء صعب ضروري تفكري فيه كذا مره. Of course because that that makes you both couple as officially husband and wife. Yeah. Mm, so when is the good timing? Mm, there's no good timing as long as both of you think it's the time to marry. <laughs> and definitely when financially stable. Uh, otherwise mm. both of you will be suffering. Yeah. Actually, marry and relationship nowadays, there is no difference. Because the couple living with each other. But um, I think yes, it is necessary. Necessary. Right? Yeah, time okay. to settle down. When is the good timing? To me? Yes. <clears throat> Maybe after a few years, after we learn each other, we know each other well. So, so two people can understand if their personalities can be together. Yeah. Some people say relationships are romantic, but marriages are very practical. Do you agree? Uh, I think that romance is okay, beautiful, beautiful. But even the engagement can be done, but some times it can be romantic and beautiful. On the person you choose to be a man and be سندك وكل شيء في الحياة هو اللي يمثل الشيء يكون عملي أو رومانسي في الحالتين هيكون حلو بعدين. I think it depends on how both of you manage the relationship whether it's before marriage or after. Yeah. So maybe the husband should surprise the wife sometimes or the wife cooks some husband's favorite dishes <laughs> sometimes to surprise him after work. Yeah, nice. I think the same. Yeah, <laughs> uh, Mary is more practical because we we become more serious, right? So we have more responsibilities to to take care. So, but in the same time, doesn't mean that Mary cannot be romantic anymore. Okay, can be. But if you wanted to keep to, uh, to keep it romantic, then you keep it romantic. Let's say seventy percent and. <laughs> And practical, of course, is there yes. when you get married. 
When we love someone, should we sacrifice everything to make them happy? Sacrifice everything? I don't think so. I think if if normally it will be with him, it will be very happy already as long as both of you are loving each other. We should sacrifice, yes, but not everything. But I mean like I don't have to sacrifice everything to make another person happy. I sacrifice 50 and another person sacrifice 50. <laughs> so we meet halfway. Yeah. <laughs> Would you introduce your lover to your parents, friends? I think that my friends will tell them, I mean, to my friends, to talk to them, but to my parents in our society, or to my parents in our society, we are here in the world, it's difficult to say to them, or to them, ندولهم إن على شخص نحبه بس أصدقائي أكيد شو؟ Of course I will because I want him to be part of my family and blend into my friends. Definitely yes. If after I understand that he is the one I'm looking for, no hesitate to introduce to my parents because I am very sure that I'm going to live with this person all my life. So. Yeah. Let's begin. Again. Subscribe her channel. I love it. Mm. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Please remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. Bye. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Bye. Bye bye.